Your teacher today is Dr. Bosa Science. Dr. Bosa is a teacher at the Science Foundation College, the best school that teaches sciences. Today, 21st December 2020, we are going to study evolution lesson 2 of three. Our website is digitalteachers.co.ug. Here find notes, exams, and their marking guides in physics, chemistry, biology, math, and primary subjects. Or visit our YouTube channel for related videos in physics, chemistry, biology, math, and primary subjects. The best secondary school in Uganda is the Science Foundation College. The best primary school in Uganda is Lock of Ages Primary School. Gini Pool. This is the stock of all different genies in an interbreeding population. A small population with small gene pool is easier to wipe out due to natural events that favor one trait over the other. Gene pools are static in a stable environment or are constantly changing from generation to generation in changing environments due to natural selection. Allelo frequency. This is the fraction of organisms in a population carrying a particular allele. Genotype frequency. This is a fraction of organisms in the population carrying a particular genotype. A genotype is made up of two alleles. The frequency of dominant and recessive alleles remain constant from generation to generation provided one, the population is large, two, mating is random, three, no mutation occurs, four, there is no emigration, five, there is no immigration. Emigration and immigration is sometimes referred to as gene flow. So provided there is no gene flow between populations. Genetic drift. This is the variation in the gene frequencies due to chance rather than natural selection. For example, a gene may be lost in a small population when a sole organism possessing it die before mating. Genetic load. This is the existence within the population unfavorable allele in a trozygous state. For example, sickle cell trait in a region where malaria is endemic. Gene flow. This is the movement of alleles from one population to another as a result of interbreeding between the members of the two populations. The trozygotes as a reservoir of genetic variation. The hand when bag principle. For a particular character in a population, the dominant form expresses itself more often than the recessive form. For example, normal skin color is more common than albino. In large population, the proportion is of dominant and recessive alleles of a particular gene remain constant in spite of interbreeding. This constant is known as the hand Weinberg principle expressed in the mathematical law as p squared plus 2 p2 plus 2 squared is equal to 1, where p 
is the frequency of allele for dominant character. Two is the frequency of allele for recessive character. Also, P plus two is equal to one. Two squared is the frequency of individuals possessing double recessive alleles or recessive trait. P squared is the frequency of individuals possessing double dominant alleles. 2P2 is the frequency of heterozygotes in the population. P squared plus 2P2 is the frequency of individuals possessing dominant trait. Application is of handy when bug formula. Example one, a mental defect is caused by double recessive allele. If the number of babies born with the mental defects is one in 20,000, calculate the frequency of heterozygotes. Let P be equal to frequency of dominant allele. Q is the frequency of recessive allele. The frequency of babies with mental defect is equal to 2 squared is equal to 1 of 20,000. Therefore, 2 is the square root of 1 over 20,000, which is equal to 0 0.0. Seven. But P plus 2 is equal to 1, therefore P is equal to 1 minus 0 0.007, which is equal to 0 0.99 for But the frequency of heterozygotes is equal to 2 P2, is equal to 2 times 0 0.99 for times 0 0.007 is equal to 0 0.0139. In other words, 139 in 10,000 are heterozygotes. Example 2. In human, albinism is caused by autosomal allele. On average, 1 10,000 is an albino. A. Give the characteristics of albino. He has pink eyes, has white hair, skin fails to turn. B. Using handy when a bag formula, P squared plus 2P2 plus 2 squared is equal to 1. Determine the frequency of albino allele. The frequency of albino is 2 squared which is equal to 1 over 10,000. Therefore, the frequency of albino allele is the square root of 1 in 10,000, which is equal to 0 0.01. Two, the frequency of heterozygotes in the population. P plus 2 is equal to 1, therefore P is equal to 0 0.99. The frequency of a trozygote is equal to 2P2 is equal to 2 times 0 0.99 times 0 0.01 is equal to 0 0.198 or 198 in 10,000s are a See, si, explain why it is difficult to eliminate recessive alleles from population. One, recessive alleles exist in the heterozygous state and only a few are eliminated in each generation from a large population in a recessive trait. Two, some recessive alleles are advantageous in heterozygous state. For example, sickle cell allele increases resistance to heterozygotes against malaria. Example 3. Explain the meaning of hand-wind bag principle. 
provided no disruptive influence such as natural selection, the frequencies of alleles in the population remain constant from generation to generation. B. State the conditions for the principle in A above. No mutation should occur. Mating is random. The population must be large. No emigration. No immigration. C. Brown eyes in the human population is caused by dominant allele. If in the population, 84% of the people have brown eyes, using hand Weinberger formula, determine the percentage of population who are 1. heterozygous for the eye color. 2. homozygous dominant for the eye color. From hand Weinberger formula, P squared plus 2 P2 plus 2 squared is equal to 1. From the question that telling us that people with dominant trait is equal to P squared plus 2 P2 is equal to 84%, which is equal to 0 0.85. Then people with recessive trait, 2 squared will be equal to 1 minus 0 0.84 is equal to 0 0.16. 2 is equal to 0 0.4. But P plus 2 is equal to 1. P is equal to 0 0.6. The proportion of heterozygous is 2 P2 is equal to 2 times 0 0.6 times 0 0.4, which is equal to 0 0.48, or 48 percent. The percentage of homozygous dominant is equal to 0 0.6 times 0 0.6 over 1 times 100 which is equal to 36 percent. Condition is that allow hand when burger principle to be true. There should be no mutation. The population should be large. Mating should be random. No emigration. No immigration into the population. Speciation is the development of a new species from pre-existing one over a period of time. A species is a group of organisms that are able to interbreed. Speciation to occur, there must be a form of genetic isolation. Isolation mechanisms. Genetic isolation can be brought about by mechanisms acting before and after fertilization. A. Prezygotic mechanisms. Barriers to formation of hybrids. Roman 1. Season isolation. Here, species mate in different seasons. 2. Ecological isolation. When two species live in the same region, but in different habitats. Three, behavioral isolation. Animals have different courtship patterns. Four, mechanical isolation. When differences in the genitalia prevent successful copulation. B, postzygotic mechanisms. One, Hybrid viability. Hybrids are produced but fail to develop. Two, hybrid sterility. Hybrids fail to produce functional gametes. Three, hybrid breakdown. F1 hybrids are fertile but F2 hybrids are not. Artificial selection. Here breeders of animals and plants select individuals with wanted characters. For example, cow for milk. In breeding is a cross between closely related individuals. Hybrid 
is a product of a cross of individuals belonging to different varieties. For example, between the local and exotic animals. The green revolution is the production of new varieties of wild major food crops, egg, rice, wheat, maize. In general, the new varieties have the following qualities. They are shorter, have high yield, show greater response to fertilizers, are resistant to pests and diseases, are insensitive to day length. There are disadvantages of green revolution. Fertilizers are expensive, irrigation may be required. Thank you so much for listening to this video. Our website is digitalteachers.co.ug. Here you find notes, exams, and their marking guides in physics, chemistry, biology, math, and primary subjects. Or visit our YouTube channel, Digital Teachers Uganda, for related videos in physics, chemistry, biology, math and primary subjects. The best secondary school in Uganda is the Science Foundation College. The best primary school in Uganda is Lock of Ages Primary School. This will give your child a foundation in the sciences.